The Interrupters Documentary by James Kidd Thesis The documentary The Interrupters was effective in its examination of Chicago's violence and murder that plagued the city because it tells the story of three individuals' past experiences in street violence and how they try to steer young people in the right direction. Defining the Purpose The film's overall purpose was to reduce the violence in Chicago's south side of Inglewood. It also spread the message to raise awareness in order to protect Chicago's communities from violence and murder. By showing the work of Ceasefire, one of Chicago's violence protection programs, it encouraged those who made the wrong decision to change their ways. Achieving the Purpose The film achieved its purpose in several ways. From the interviews with its founders to the real-life footage of the different situations these teenagers filmed in the documentary encountered. The three stories of the main violence interrupters, Amina Matthews, Kobe Williams, and Eddie Bocanegra, allow you to relate to what they went through growing up, being in and out of jail constantly, to your own personal life. Their personal stories tell you all about the struggles they had being a teenager, growing up in the city of Chicago, and how they were eventually able to get their life together and back on track. Bias. Throughout the documentary as a whole, there weren't any opposing viewpoints that were displayed of those who were against the work of Ceasefire. You didn't get to see what happened when the police showed up to the shooting of Darian Albert. It only filled them arriving to the scene and then it was cut off. This film only focuses on the violence in Chicago's south side and not the city as a whole. After some class discussions about what we thought of the film as a whole after we finished watching it, we found out that Amina was fired from Ceasefire recently for her false representation of her hours worked. Conclusion The Interrupters attempt to steer teenagers in the right direction was successful because it reduced the violence happening in Chicago and raised awareness to stop the shooting. I felt this film taught its general audience of teenagers and young adults a life lesson on how they have to treat each other with respect in order to keep the community they live in a safe environment. It gave me a new perspective about how where you grow up can play a huge role in how you act as an individual out in the community. A program like Ceasefire should continue to be funded by the state because they're trying to encourage young adults to change their ways for good in order for them to become a productive member of our society.